Hey everybody, it is uh, TIFF Tuesday. That's TIFF Tuesday because I just got back from uh, the Toronto International Film Festival. Oh, by the way, hope everybody had a good weekend. Anyway, I just got back from Toronto. I was at the film festival and it was the first time I ever went and I had a great time. I only saw two movies, um, but both were premiere screenings. I think they were both the North American premieres or something. I'm not sure. The first movie I went to this afternoon was Intruders, uh, which starred Clive Owen. Going in, I was expecting it to be like a, a real scary, scary movie. So in that regard, it was a little bit of a letdown, but it was still it was still a really good movie. Um, just about, uh, I don't know, it, it plays into your fears that you had as a kid and then how they kind of come back when you get older. And what was really great about that movie was afterwards they did a Q&A. Oh, sorry. No. It was before the movie. I'm all flustered here because this happened. But anyway, before the movie, the director and Clive Owen went on stage and they introduced the movie, blah, 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 blah. And then they came off the stage. I was sitting on the aisle and they were both coming towards me down the aisle to go to their seats behind me and I'm sitting here I'm like oh my god oh my god oh my god they're coming near me what am I gonna do what am I gonna do do I do anything do I look at them what do I do but anyway they they both just walked right beside me I was like oh my god <sighs> but so yeah that was basically that's pretty much my only celebrity encounter in my entire life I think I don't remember anything else after that I went and saw 50-50 with uh, Seth Rogen and Joseph Gordon-Levitt. Um, that one was a really, 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 really great movie. Um, it, uh, I'm sure everybody has seen the trailers for it, but anyway, um, a guy gets diagnosed with cancer and he, it's basically the movie is about him dealing with that and his friend played by Seth Rogen is kind of the comic relief. I know that the trailer kind of makes it out to be kind of a comedy, uh, but there are a few dark parts to it. I highly recommend going to see that when it comes out in theaters. Um, it was very, very heartwarming, and I did almost cry at a few parts. Um, and there was definitely some, ah, that's so sweet kind of kind of moments in it. My question for this video that I hope everybody, everybody who watches this should answer this question. What's your favorite movie, and why? Um, I guess I should probably answer that question as well. My favorite movie is very, very difficult to choose. Um, for simply the nostalgia factor, I would say my favorite movie is Rookie of the Year. Um, just because growing up, I used to watch that movie all the time. And one year, I even had a New Year's resolution to watch it, like, several hundred times or something for the year. I think I made it to, like, ten by the middle of the year or a few months in into the new year. And then I kind of gave up on it. But, but, yeah, I've seen that movie, like, probably close to a hundred times. Okay, maybe not that much. Maybe, like, I've seen that movie maybe 20, 20 times. And I can basically, I, I know it by heart, essentially. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, please comment. Um, and you can also follow me on Twitter and Tumblr and see what I'm up to um, throughout the day, I guess. It might be interesting. I, I could be like a really awesome tweeter and nobody knows because nobody's following me. So go follow me there and Go check out Tumblr and whatever. Everything is down there. And I will see everybody next time. So, bye!